We are going to have a communication satellite of 6,500 kg USA built communication satellite which is going to be launched within a couple of months. That speaks volume. When it comes to Honorable Prime Minister of our country, he is a different person with great tangential thinking. The vision, direction given by him, based on his vision, we are going to have a Chandrayaan 4 mission. We are going to have a Venus Orbiter mission. We are going to have a space station called BAS. By 2035, India will have a space station on its own. And the first module will be lifted off by 2028. And he has given approval for a NGLV, Next Generation Launcher. And Next Generation Launcher configuration, little bit we have modified. The first launcher which lifted off from Indian soil, the SLV-3, the project director was none other than APG Abdul Kalam and done under the work, under the leadership role of Professor Sadis Tawan. That capability of the vehicle was hardly 35 kg to low earth orbit. I don't underestimate capability. At that point of time, it was a great capability. And the lift-off mass of the rocket was 17 ton. From that, we have moved gradually step by step. Today, we, are, we have conceived a rocket to take 80,000 kg to low earth orbit and a 40-story height rocket with 2,600 ton capability lift of mass capability, powered by 27, 240 ton logs methane engine. What a significant and great progress. And dear friends, lot of new technologies we have demonstrated this year. The semi propulsion system, we have made breakthrough. The test stand was declared to the country by Honorable Prime Minister of India in 2023. We have completed almost seven tests in that test stand. High thrust electric propulsion, lot of things 